Oh, powering the electroshock machine. Perfect. Thank you, Jindosh. There's insufficient power to operate. Until this is rectified, I'll have to compensate freeing up more power for the electroshock machine by configuring the other laboratory platform so they draw the least power. So I need the things that draw the least amount of power. Yes. Oh, this thing takes forever to set up. Ooh. That looks pretty good. I hope I don't have to get that all the way up to the top. Um, let's give this a shot. Mm, doesn't sound like success. Oh, we're getting there. Oh. Ow. Oh. Very close, but not enough. Hold on. Before I go shifting any other platforms, because I'm pretty sure Woodcraft has, like, the least amount of fucking power necessary. Let's see if there's another fucking switch somewhere. Oh, God. This guy has a fucking picture of Sokolov just hanging up in his fucking lab area. That's weird. Oh, yeah. I guess I'm still off camera, so this is kind of like, eh making my fucking editing work harder. But I found out that Sokolov was not the person I fucking thought it was. Uh, I, see, I thought Sokolov was the fucking uh, dude that helped you with your building stuff in the first game, but that was apparently Piero. Sokolov was some guy that you went and uh, kidnapped, but you had the option of killing. Oh, I should take this as well. Yeah, you had the option of killing Sokolov, but I, I guess this is the game where... This is like the reality where that never happened. This is the reality if the first game everyone did the perfect ending. Meanwhile, this game tries to be the reality where you have no fucking chance of getting the perfect ending. Oh, I wonder if this is saying how much power this is taking. If that's the case, then goddamn. Yeah, no, woodcrafting. Goddamn, why is woodcrafting taking so much fucking power? Alright. Oh! Oh, cool, and it just fucking automatically tells me when it's good. God damn it. Okay, welcome back to Gator Snapper Play Through Dishonor 2. But that was a big fucking hassle. My god. It's just, like, I didn't think woodcraft would take so much power. I guess I was thinking of it as in, like, he was just carving wood with a tool, but of course not. He's a fucking big old smart scientist, man. He's got power tools for that. The rest of it was just, I don't know. It was something. I mean, it, I, this wasn't the kind of puzzle where it's like, this is bullshit, how is this supposed to get? It literally is just, like, fucking, like, try each one individually. But I was just getting impatient with it, which is why I was upset, so. One way or another, we're here now, and Jindosh is, uh, I don't know, is he asleep? It looks like his eyes are open. I don't know, he's not even strapped in. I guess he wants this to happen. He, <laughs> no, he does not give consent. This, he doesn't want this to happen at all. Whatever, let's just avoid saying weird things like that and electroshock this boy. How you doing, Jindo? I don't even know, like, what the real end goal of this is. Like, well, I guess... Oh, yeah, he's getting fucking electroshocked. Oh. I, I, oh, yeah. I mean, I get the ideas to make him, like... Yeah. This kind of is mean. Yeah, because he was a genius. He's kind of an asshole, but... I mean, we're frying his brain so that he'll be kind of just, like, passive, which kind of sucks. Yeah. Oh, no. This this does... This does... Like, this is the same thing as with that guy in Game of Thrones that they threw gold on his head. Uh, it's just like, I don't feel good about this kind of shit happening, even if they're bad people. Oh, man. Maybe I should kill him now. <laughs> what happens if I try to kill him now? Oh. Oh, this is sad. This is like what they did with, um... The fucking science lady at the last level. Alright, well... Shit, that hurts, but that's, uh... That's it. I guess we're good now. Let's get the fuck out of here. I mean, it is true. He was playing on doing that to Sokolov. And it's like, we're friends with Sokolov, so that's fucked up, too. But still, like... God dang. I, I honestly would have felt better about just killing him. Like, personally, but I know that gives me the fucking bad ending. This feels more like a fucking evil, chaotic thing to do, in all honesty, to me, but what do I know? Let's get the fuck out of here, I guess. Uh, and actually, do I still- oh, fuck. Of course there's still some in here. God damn it, can I have anything be easy? Oh shit, and that thing I realized where I was like, oh yeah, you could stab the fucking whale oil things in their back. It doesn't matter because they got a fucking eyeball in the back of their head. Oh my god, alright. Well, maybe now that the thing's actually set to easy mode, rather than me just backing out all fucking willy-nilly, maybe they'll have a harder time spotting me. That, and I think the robots do have, like, a shorter range of vision. Where did he go? He was literally standing right there. Oh, he's behind the staff. Okay. I was like, oh my god. It's like crawling on the ceiling. Uh -huh. Yeah. What? Oh, 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 oh. No, 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 not at all. None of that. Oh, fuck. They still got long. 
They still got long fucking fields of vision. Okay, hold on. What do we got down here? Is there still one down in this area? I don't care anymore. Let's just fucking move. I'm in the shadows. I should be fucking invisible. Maybe I should get that ability that makes me harder to detect in shadows. From what I read, though, because I was I was literally at the point of like having to look up guides to be like, what is what do I need to do to make this game fucking easier for me? I guess besides turning the difficulty down. And, uh, I mean, it's still the thing of, like, people are like, even on easy mode, this game is hard. Uh, and a lot of people were saying, like, yeah, best abilities to give your your character uh, tend to be Domino and um, the other one, I don't, Doppelganger. But that's still the thing of, like, I, I, I mean, I want to play this game my way. I'll, I'll try, like, I want to do something uh, different. It's just, you know, there's a, there's a, a, there's a path of least resistance that other people found out, and that's why I'm kind of like, I should keep fucking going with it. But, oh, uh, I don't know, we'll see. Now that we're here, now that we've finally been the fucking horrifying clockwork mansion, I'm, I'm assuming everything's going to be, like, downhill from here, and uh, my life will be easy. Oh, we've got a long way to go to get back to Megan Foster. This thing better go, like, all the way back there. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, Sokolov, how you been doing? <laughs> you been feeling all right? Uh, I feel like he's not going to be happy with what we had done to, uh, what's his face? Um, we want to go to lower event, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, get this thing moving. God, he looks like a corpse. Jeez, when are you going to wake up? To oh, uh, I thought I saw his eyes flicker. That was just a weird fucking... Oh, no, no, his eyes are flickering. I am not imagining that. Yeah, see, he's still doing it. That is creepy. He's, like, pretending to sleep, but very badly. He's doing it, like, at a perfect timing, too. It's like every fucking four seconds he's doing it. Oh, it's so creepy. I don't like you, Sokolov. Good thing you didn't get an electroshock too much, apparently. Maybe he has like a fucking natural resistance to it. He's like, oh, I electroshock myself all the time. Oh, oh, what is that? What is that? Why? Why noise? What's going on? Oh, God. God damn it. Sokolov, I swear to God, if you're able to die... Oh, Jesus, I do have to, I still have to carry his ass out of here. Jesus Christ, this game is fucking brutal. Alright, um, I'm half tempted to just fucking run through the whole place. I don't even know how to get out of this building, in all honesty. Like, me getting into the building in the first place felt like I glitched it out. Alright, let's fucking try our best, I guess. I know, uh, why well, I did kill a lot of people, so maybe it'll be easy. Uh, that sound is like, <sighs> what is that? So that sound is like the danger sound, I feel. It's like when somebody almost detects you. Man, I don't know. Uh, let's see. Oh, I could... Oh, I could go out back through here again. Might make life easy. I could also just, un like, depower the whale oil doodadder. I don't know. I'm gonna go through the back, actually. You know, just don't go through the front door. That, and when I fucking turn that wall off, I'm pretty sure it'll open. Uh, or, pfft, yes, it'll... Oh, God, I am so... Upset with my... That's just a shadow of paper. Okay. I'm so upset with my brain's autopilot. It always goes to the wrong place. I was gonna say, like, I'm pretty sure if I turn the fucking, uh, uh, wall of light off, everyone's gonna notice and be like, hey, what's wrong with the wall of light? And thus making that exit a terrible idea. But I do remember I have a pathway through here that I neglected to use when it could have been slightly useful. Well, I think is that I had fucking only found out about it after the fact, so I don't know, but let's see. Uh, oh, no, I guess there's no traps. I guess I already dealt with those. It's like, oh shit, I gotta look out for tripwires. Sure, I'll be fine. I swear, though, if Sokolov has, like, a fucking chance to die like this, I'm gonna be annoyed as all fuck. And sorry for the incessant quick saves. I'm just doing it for my own convenience, where it's like, if I die, I want to, like, be semi-close to, uh, like, somewhere that's not stupidly, annoyingly far away. Uh, what is that noise? Hmm. Dark vision? Okay. I think we're good. I don't think there's anyone in sight of me. Oh, God, the Megan's over there. This was, like, towards a uh, black market. Oh, shit, wasn't there a fucking... Do I get a map? I don't think I get a map in this game. Jesus. All right, let's go this way, I guess. Nah, man, I don't know. Pretty sure, like, there's... Yep, 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 Oh, fuck. All right, I don't give a shit. Ah, ha, ha, what the fuck was that? Did someone just throw a goddamn Mortal Kombat? What the fuck is that? Oh, no, what is that? What the fuck? Okay, no, I, I, uh, hello. Oh, good muggers. Oh, why are there fucking zombies? Ah, leave me alone. Oh, that's fucking Paula. You know what? This is, uh, this ain't gonna fucking do it. I'm just gonna let this happen. Okay, so there's fucking, like, witches now or something? Ooh-wee, okay. 
That's something to look out for. Don't get spotted by those. Ah, oh, God, that was, I've... Uh, carrying Sokolov, I'm not going to be able to sprint, so I'm just going to have to be very fucking careful. Do those count against my score if I kill these things? Because those, those seem like goddamn weird witchy monsters. Oh, and I see. I need to go over there. That's where I should have gone. Uh, okay. I don't know what that's all about. I, are these supposed to be, like, the infected people? Like, uh, Weepers from Dishonored 1? Like, but, you know, not Weepers because that was, like, a whole different thing. What are they? This, I feel like this is like punishment for my chaos. Uh, like, I don't know, it's, well, I don't know. I th it's gotta be that, right? Like, they definitely seem, um, sort of along those lines. But they're magic, obviously. And they don't seem like they're sick or anything. It's not like a blood fly plague or whatever. This is weird. Uh, this would have been a great time to have, oh, you know what? Doppelganger? Ha ha ha. Save my life, doppelganger. Oh, but, god, I wish I could go further. Alright, doppelganger, do your fucking job. Yeah. No, don't run towards me, you fuck! God damn it, doppelganger. You fool oh, oh, they weren't they weren't where I thought they were. Okay, well. Ah, uh, this is uh this is great. This is wonderful. <laughs> this is going wonderfully. Just gonna run out in here. I take no damage. Wow, I like playing on easy mode. <laughs> okay, let's just fucking keep going. Hopefully there's no thing... Uh, oh, fuck, there's a lot of these things. Alright, you know what? Oh, God, moving is so hard. Oh, fuck, there's more of them. Hey, lady, get us the fuck out of here. Yeah, no, I'm safe over here because I'm in a fucking cutscene now. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Uh, can we turn around and see what's going on behind us, Megan? Ah, uh, I think I know what's going on. Uh -huh. Yeah, let's do that now, please. Thank God it didn't give me the whole thing of like, Oh, sorry, you can't talk to me. There's people right behind you. I don't want to be associated with you right now. Jesus. Hey, zero civilians killed. Twelve hostiles killed, but no, whatever. I mean, look at that. I'm not going nearly as far towards the lethal end of things now. It's just assault. Oh, this is still fucking high chaos. Oh boy. Can't wait for that brutal fucking ending. Probably gonna wind up killing Corvo at this rate. He's gonna wake up from his statue sleep and be like, What the fuck? I, I didn't raise you like this. You were such a sweet girl when you were 10 and being kidnapped and then having to stay in weird bars with smelly old people. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. I'm half expecting... I'm in, okay, I'm half expecting for it to be like, you're in a weird dream again. Investigate the strange gravity. Uh, the only strange gravity here is the fucking weight of my actions. I'm in the strange gravity realm again. But somehow different this time. Yeah, it's true. It's a lot rootier than it is rocky. Alright, well, let's see what's going on up here. It's probably Delilah, in all honesty. She's probably like, hey, 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 I'm a witch now. I can fucking control the void and bother you in your sleep. Let's see. Uh, well, it's an orange light this time. It is Delilah. <sighs> More bothered than anything. I just wanted to sleep. Uh-huh. Yep. You still have that phlegm in the back of your throat, lady. Gotta calm down with that. Can't we, like... Uh, uh, close as sisters, but were you sisters? Oh. Oh, you? Okay, yeah, I guess it's talking about her. She literally kind of just told you that... She told you enough to kind of infer, like, oh, yeah. I mean, it's a bad explanation, but it's like, you know, fucking blame magic. You, you can't, because you're a dirty fucking bastard child. I don't know, do you... I guess it's still a bastard child. I don't know. When they're, like, female, I mean. I don't remember. Jessamine is actually related, you know. Wait... No, I'm pretty sure, yeah, Jessamine is properly related. It's gotta be, like, Delilah's the weird one. <laughs> the weird one. The bastard child one. Unless it's like, oh, sorry, in this reality, we prefer bastard children. So, uh, Jessamine is the one that we want to be empress. It's like, what? Okay. We fucking defy all n normal conventions, I see. I mean, Delilah's just trying to show us, like, her, her motivation. It's like, okay, I understand. Oh, you gotta go for the poses, huh? Uh-huh. Oh. Oh. That does sound pretty shit. But, I mean, you were still posing as a daughter, didn't you? Oh. I think he was manipulating you. I don't know. I don't know anything about the dad. Or grandfather, I guess, to my character. 
Oh. Wow. Even I'm like, well, I guess we were children. Children do that shit, but. Oh, no. Like, I can feel bad, but I'm still pretty upset with how this all turned out. Uh huh. Yeah. Ah. Uh. Yeah, God, even as a child, fucking Delilah had that, that short haircut. Uh -huh. Wow, Jessamine. Even though you were a kid, I should like pull out the heart right now and be like, come on, Mom, what the fuck? And Mom's just like, listen, I was a kid. I was scared. I didn't know any better. Oh, uh, all right. Let's fuck oh, I like how I'm doing the fucking JoJo run when I sprint. All right, come on, fucking Emily. Let's see. What's next? What other fucking sad backstory do we get to hear about Delilah Longbutt? Oh. 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 Mm. That that does sound pretty bad. You're you're lucky that I'm empathetic. Uh, makes sense. Like she's she's pretty upset. Uh. Ooh, I wonder if I ever got lore for that in the previous game. Yeah. I don't like where I keep having to readjust the camera myself because it keeps putting me into weird places. It's like why am I looking off to the side? <laughs> Emily's. Uh, upset. Uh huh. Kicked off. Oh, oh died. Uh -huh. I see. Fucking Dunwall slang. Uh. Dang. I'm surprised they didn't like put the debt on the child. Like that's that's how America does it. It's like if you have a fucking loan and you die, that goes straight to your uh, that goes straight to your fucking immediate family. Pretty fucked, but yeah, that's how it is. Maybe the corona will change everything. Uh, for the worse, probably. I don't know, we'll see. We'll get there when we get there. I mean, <laughs> what would be better? Having to deal with the fucking corona or like, I don't know, weird fucking magic plague people like I had to fight just now. Oh, fight's a strong word. I just ran right out. Let's see, what were we talking about with Sokolov? Uh huh, made whale oil. Oh, damn, what did Piero ever do? Oh, he, he, we did make him dumb. Dang. I guess he had already done his fucking... I guess, what's his face? Uh, Jindosh had already done the, the fucking deed. That sucks. I still feel bad. Like, I still feel bad about what we did to Jindosh, but... Oh, God, he's blinking again. Stop it. Ugh. Oh god, who are we going to go after next? Probably the art lady, um, the one that I think has like all the bandages wrapped around her head. I swear, there's like when I think of her it's like, oh yeah, she's like an art character for, in this game. I don't know. We'll see. I mean, it's also the last thing I'd seen mentioned. Uh, hello. Oh. Mom, you you got to fucking tell me, man. Like why why'd you blame Delilah? Yeah, kind of. You broke the pot. Like, you wouldn't have been whipped if you had told them. Jeez. That is true. Like, you, she got in trouble for breaking... She would have gotten in trouble, rather, for breaking a, uh, like, famous fucking... Uh, so I thought that'd be an item I'd be able to use. Like, she she would have gotten in trouble, but she wouldn't have been whipped and kicked out of the house. Like, god dang. Oh, I didn't mean to... What am I doing here? I'm writing my travel... Oh, okay. It's that's that's neat. I guess. I guess one one day I'll look back at those. Yep, that's all for your writing today. Oh, we got a head as a trophy. Neat. Hopefully those will never be made ever again. Hopefully the notes don't still remain somewhere. All right, here. How's everyone doing? Oh, so is he really ready for a fucking meeting? Uh huh. Is he sane? I kind of figured he'd still be fucking messed up. Uh huh. Yeah. What's wrong with people like that? I don't know. Now he's got a lot wrong with him. Do you feel that way, Sokolov? Yeah. Now he's dumb. I'm, I'm right here, you know. Are they like friends or lovers or something? I don't know. I wonder what their relationship is. Like, what does Megan, uh, what did Megan get from, from Sokolov? They're obviously, like, good friends. Uh-huh. Hold on, before we have this meeting, I must extinguish these candles from here. Uh-huh. I was literally standing right here the entire time, you guys. Uh-huh. Listen, stop making fun of the fact that I was rich. 
<laughs> okay, can't I just start briefing here? Oh, of course, the cutscene. All right. Oh, we're sitting like the fucking cool stepdad trying to tell you, like, hey, it's okay. I'll be your new dad. We can play ball. Yeah, I see that. Look at his fucking face. Uh -huh. Well, I mean, not technically missing. We know where he is. He's a rock. Oh. Megan is right. Uh huh. I can make electricity move from one side of the room to the other. That's wow, magic. It's magic. Didn't you try to study the outsider? I swear, Sokolov tried to like study that magic stuff. Oof. Your fault. Oh. It was too late. Huh. Dang. Well, she lives with us now, so, uh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, he drew a picture. Aha! Uh -huh. Is that the one with all the fucking bandages on her face? Because if so, I knew it. Oh, no. She, I mean, she should have bandages on her face. She is quite old. How did that stick to the wall? <laughs> oh. Ooh, that sounds cool. Cool and fancy. Oh, what do you know? Yeah, let's let's get cracking. Uh huh. Evil magical things one can assume. Are we just gonna look at her for a bit? She looks like a mean fucking like teacher lady, like a governess. All right, well let's see. It looks like next up, well, yeah, we're just heading straight out for the next mission. I suppose on that note, this is a perfect place to stop. So yeah, this has been a Gator Snapper playthrough. See you guys in the next one. Later, everybody.